Now students come to the second last poster deformity according to your syllabus that is known as Leiosis. Basically, Leiosis is a problem of lumbar spine. I have already explained in the previous video that there is a basic two parts of our uh, spine, spinal cord. Number one is clavicle spine, the upper part of uh, our spinal cord, and the lower part, this is the center part, that is known as the lumbar spine. Lumbar spine is basically divided <coughs> in seven parts from L1 to L7, and this lumbar spine is also known as the power bank, power bank of human body. The meaning of this particular postural deformity, leiosis. Leiosis is the problem of lumbar spine. In this posture, the lumbar spine bends in front beyond the normal level. Meaning to say, if we are going for the normal cur curve of lumbar spine, sorry, of spinal cord, that is in shape like this. But in the leiosis problem, the abnormal curve comes in the lumbar spine in this particular form and this creates a lordosis poster deformity in human body and what happens after this particular occurs in human body the stomach part go forward stomach part goes forward beyond the line of the shoulders this is known as the lordosis postural deformity now the causes of this particular postural deformity number one is weak abdomen muscles if the person is having the weak abdomen muscles that may cause the leiosis postural deformity overweight or obesity if the person is having the overweight or the obesity problem that is also causes the leiosis postural deformity and the last one is sedentary lifestyle mean to say less physical work less physical workout is also may cause the leiosis postural deformity now come to the corrective measures of this particular postural deformity number one is paschimottanasana uh, all of you are knowing about the posture, body posture of Paschimottana Asana. Next one is forward uh, Hala Asana, block position because it, these all kind of asanas already teach you uh, in chapter uh, yoga. Next one is forward bending because here the lumbar spine bends forward, bends forward and the stomach is going beyond the shoulder line so the forward bending exercises are important, corrective measures for leiosis postural deformity and the last one and the most important corrective measure that is alternate toe touch so this is the meaning cause and corrective measures of leiosis postural deformity now students come to the last postural deformity according to your cerebral that is known as sclerosis sclerosis is the problem of spine in which vertical columns bends to side word mean to say from this particular part where the because everyone knows this thing our spine is combinations uh, co making a combinations of this vertebral columns if the vertebral columns bends towards right or left in that particular case human body is suffering from sclerosis postural deformity causes of this sclerosis postural deformity difference in leg length if the person is having a by birth difference between the leg length that may also cause of po sclerosis postural deformity because the weight is shifted towards the one side, either it is on the left side or either it is on the right side. Next cause is undeveloped legs or backbone. If the person is having undeveloped leg or the backbone by its heredity or by the before birth or after birth, that also causes sclerosis poster deformity. Next one is lifting weight at one side of shoulder. If the person is having a habit of uh, lifting weight at only one side of a shoulder either it is right or left side that may also cause the sclerosis postural deformity now the corrective measures of this particular sclerosis postural deformity number one is ardh chakra asana ardh chakra asana is also a sideward bending exercise so it is very much helpful uh, to cure from this sclerosis postural deformity trikona asana trikona asana is also uh, we can say the sideward bending exercise so it is very much helpful to curing the sclerosis postural deformity Tara Asana Tara Asana is a uh, straight uh, uh, sorry uh, Tara Asana Tara Asana is a straight position of the body that also um, tries to bring the vertical columns in a straight line and the last one is chin ups so students in today's class we are go through from the four postural deformities number one is
kyphosis next one is round shoulder next one is leiosis and scoliosis so up to this particular part your posterior posterior deformity which is including your uh, slaver that is completed thank you thank you very much